Crazy Cow and I'm here, and welcome back to another tutorial. Now today, I'm going to be showing you how to add your own custom sounds into Minecraft via resource packs. Obviously, because you how else would you do it? I don't know. I don't know what else how you... <laughs> Uh, anyway, so first, what you gotta do is get your sound. I personally don't know what sound I'm gonna get, so we're gonna go to position music. Yeah. Oh man, we're gonna sign in here. Oh, oh man, look at that. Indian motorcycles be legendary. Oh, well, she arms again. Man, okay, we're just gonna go trailer music. Um, let's grab. Actually, I bet you have some music in here. Do I? That doesn't look like music. Nope, that's not music. Uh, no, oh, oh, this is music. That's good enough. Alright. <laughs> So, first what you gotta do is you're gonna wanna go to your finder and you're gonna wanna find Minecraft. Your Minecraft folder. Now, you can find this multiple ways. We're actually just gonna go directly to the resource pack folder. So, what you can do is you can launch your Minecraft. It shouldn't take too long. Uh, boop. Launch your Minecraft. Okay, that's... Um... Um... Um, um, you don't see that. That's not, I'll probably be spending the time to blur that out. What the heck? Date. Let's check the Mojang website about that one. Mojang.com. What you doing? That's that. Okay, okay that's, that's safe. Whatever. Alright, and the other way you can do it is options. Launch your Minecraft, go to options, go to resource packs, press open resource packs folder. And we get some nice little background music. We ignore the washing machine. That, that is what's making that noise. <laughs> That's the washing machine. <laughs> it's right behind me. So rip. Now what you're gonna do is, it, whoops, in your resource packs folder, you're just going to create a new folder. And you can call it whatever you want. I'm just, uh, t, t sounds. And in T sounds, we're gonna create a new folder called. Hey, new folder called assets. And in assets, you're gonna create Minecraft. And in Minecraft, you're gonna create sounds. If that went too fast for you, oh well. No. <laughs> so it's asset. So you're gonna create your um, resource pack folder. Then after you've done that, you're gonna open that. Then inside of that, you're gonna create a folder called assets. Close that. Um, and then in assets, you can create another folder called Minecraft. Hey, can you not, please? I, I'm busy. Okay, can, can you not with that? Um, and then in Minecraft, you can create another folder, finally, called Sounds. Now, if you want to, you can create another folder in Sounds called, like, Custom or... Whatever. I'm not gonna do that just for simplicity reasons of deleting things or not deleting things. Why did I... <sighs> of doing things basically of typing the command essentially. Okay, so now that's that's done. You're going to go all the way back to here, um, and you're gonna create a new text file. Although it's actually not gonna be a text file. Um, one second, I can't remember how you write it out completely. So you're gonna create this pack up, packed at MC Meta. Uh, open with this, please. I don't think this will ruin it. And it should just do something like this. Uh, wait a sec. T sounds and new. Okay, then so what we're gonna do is open your text editor. I'm gonna use TextMate for this. Just just because like feel cool like that. We're gonna do new. And then in it, you're gonna type curly bracket. And obviously this auto completes it, which is nice, probably partially why I'm using it. Two spaces, quote, pack, colon, another curly bracket, enter. Um, under that, you're going to do two spaces. You're going to do, quote, pack, 
format, and then end quote, and then one, comma, enter, then descript, description, make sure to spell this right, descript, Shin, I think I spelled that right. We're, we should be good. And then you can call it whatever. You can put whatever description you want in here. I'm going to put tutorial, tutorial for sounds pack. Um, and then you're going to enter. And then you're going to enter. Then delete that. There we go. That's for that. And that's for that. There we go. Now you can save this. We're just going to do save as make sure you do that and we're going to save it as untitled we're going to save it as pack.mc meta all right and we're going to save that in minecraft here uh, yeah yeah save so that should be pack.mc meta in here Hopefully I did that right. <laughs> if I didn't, go ahead, kill me. Um, now what we're going to do is we're going to go to media. So you already have your sound, hopefully you've already downloaded that. And you're going to go to media.io. Right, this is very important. You actually you can't skip the step whatsoever. And you're going to press select files to upload. And you're going to find your music. Or your uh, that's, uh, music. Just take the fi f first one, Fig one, which is Asphyxia and Jim Yosef Everlasting, uh, NCS. And then you're going to output format. You're going to click dot .og, O-G-G. You can choose whatever one. I'm going to do extreme. And you can press convert, and then it'll upload and be busy. Now what we're going to do, this new tab. Actually, yeah, we'll do new tab. And then you're going to type JSON Editor Online. At j j Jason Editor Online dot org. Um, <laughs> okay. Now, actually, one second. Let's uh, open URL. Nope. Whoops. Nope. Okay. <laughs> So, this is essentially what you're going to be doing. I can actually afford to delete all this because I don't really care where I'm going to save it. So, uh, dink, 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 dink. There we go. So, what you're going to do <laughs> is while this is converting over here, you're going to grab this, you're going to go to JSON Editor Online. And you're going to make a JSON, which is sounds.json. It's how you tell the Minecraft Minecraft that you're um, that there's new sounds, what the new sounds are. Um, so first, what you do is you're going to put curly bracket. So I just like type this on along with you. I think no. So you got curly bracket, and you're going to go down. You're going to enter one, enter one two spaces. That was two spaces. Quotation. Air type the name of the sound. Now this is not going to be called name of sound. The name. This is not going to be called welcome. We're just going to rename it sound or uh, uh, music music one. And you're gonna end quote. This should automatically do I think. And semicolon or colon and then space and then curly bracket. And then down here you're gonna do two more spaces from music from that quotation mark at music one there. Mm, quotation, and you're going to type category. This is not changeable. Don't jam or change that. And then you're going to type another quotation, colon, space, quotation, master. Now, this is what category it's in, or like control, what what category controls it. So you could go, here, so you have master, music, jukebox, noteblocks, weather, blocks, hostile, friendly, players, ambient, and voice slash speech. You can do all those, and then you come down, do another enter, whoops, do another enter, keep the same amount of spaces, quotation, and sounds, and quotation, then you're going to 
colon, and then you're going to space and square bracket, and then enter space space, curly bracket, enter space space, quotation, name, quotation, colon, and you're going to type the name once again in here. There you go. And then you're gonna type stream, or you're gonna enter, and then type stream with the quotation, false, and then do this, and then close all your brackets. You don't have to make that all night neat like that, but you can. Now we're gonna set stream to true. Basically, what this means is instead of loading the entire sound at once, it's just loading it as it goes along, so that prevents the huge lag spike. Uh, before you start playing the sound. Uh, now what we're going to do is we're going to save to disk. I think, yep, save to disk. And this thing should automatically save it as document.json. J-S-O-N. If I had good eyes. Yeah, document.json. And you're just going to rename that to sounds.json. And then in here, this should be done converting, or not, apparently. Wow, that's, that's rude. Rude. There, I'm going to press download. That'll download that. Then we are going to stick that to new download. Should be called the same thing, which means I passed it, because that's, that's, I'm great like that, man. Uh, here's the AUG, and you're gonna put that in sounds, and you're gonna rename it Music 1 or whatever you called your thing. And then you should be able to go to Minecraft, hopefully I don't prove myself wrong, and screw up and be dumb. Hopefully. Nope, um, ignore that, nope, 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 Not that world, that world sucks. Uh, 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 No, let's not do that. Okay. Uh, wait, I think there's another world here that I keep passing up. Oh, uh, maybe not. Okay, let me find it. Here we go. How's this? Draw the title. Okay, now theoretically, you should be able to. This is like another random redstone world, except it has some houses on it. Um, then you're type play sound. You should know this command. Um, it's gonna be. Mm, I'm gonna skip the Minecraft colon thing. It's gonna be music one. Uh, it's master. You don't have to make this match, but I'm gonna put it under master. Master. Crazy comm. Oh, that should be good. Right? No. Oh, whoops. Ha! <laughs> you gotta remember to put the resource pack on. Man, why? Hopefully it's in here. Hopefully, yes! I don't care if it's made for an older version of Minecraft. It's not, really. I just forgot to... Okay, so, <laughs> if you want to update the version of that, so it doesn't say that, and so people don't kill you, what you can do is you can change this to two or three. Three is for the snapshots, two is for, um... Yeah. I, th I think I turned it on right, yep. Two is for uh, 1.10, I think. Yeah! remember that now there's some other stuff you have to do if you want to do some stuff so if you want to add more sounds I'm not actually gonna add another sound but if you want to add more sounds what you can do so you're gonna put a comma on this one 
this curly bracket, and you literally just copy this, paste it there, um, delete that, <laughs> don't copy that top one, delete the comma, change the name to like, music 2 maybe, save it, you got two sounds, music 1, music 2, music 2 does not exist, but that's okay, oops, I just hit my headphones, that was stupid, <laughs> um, so yeah, basically that is how you make your own custom sound, add your own custom sounds in Minecraft. We we'll go over that real quick. So first, what you gotta do is create your own resource pack folder and all this stuff. Whoopsies. And then what you gotta do is you gotta go get your sound and convert it using Media IO or whatever converter you wanna use. Then you go and make a JSON file for that to tell Minecraft that there's a new sound in the folder. Then you're gonna go and put your music or sound file in here and make sure it's in OGG format, OGG. And then go into Minecraft, load up your texture pack, and play the music. <laughs> it actually started the music. Wow. Anyway. Oh dear. It's broken. No. Okay, this is creepy. Stop. What does this do? Time for a portal. Huh. Somehow it doesn't look like it's playing effect portal. Anyway. So, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to make your own custom sound, or how to not make your own custom sounds, but how to add your own custom sounds in Minecraft. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. Peace!